What's up guys, Captain Coin Collector here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna go through $1,000 worth of $2 bills. Just picked them up from the bank today. What we're searching for today are some pretty cool serial numbers. Um, bills that look in good condition, possibly to sell, as well as 1976 red seals and errors. So let's get into it. So this is my first time actually buying this many $2 bills at once. Usually I just see what the bank has to offer and buy from there. But this time I ordered $1,000 worth of $2 bills. I'm pretty excited to go through them, see what I could find, and possibly try to sell them once I'm done. Uh, I've sold them in the past. I've sold them on apps like Macari, uh, but they were in uncirculated condition and consecutive serial numbers, but I still made some money off of them. But I'm gonna start to go through them, and if I find anything interesting, I'll show you guys on the camera. All right, so I'm gonna go through some of them. So right now, I'm just sorting them out to see which ones are in good enough condition to sell, and which ones I will be putting back into circulation. I'm also looking at the serial numbers to see if we have any low serial numbers, some funky ones, or some of the star notes, which would be a perfect addition to anybody's collection. But so far, we just have a few bills that look good enough to try to sell, and that's what I've been doing so far. Now, I found this bill. One thing that I do love about bills is that sometimes people write on them. I uh, can't quite understand what this one's about, but when written on, each seller bill has a message and very different ones all the time, you know? I found ones on, with birthdays on them. One, I have like a 1953 bill with a date 1961 on it. I find them pretty fascinating and also good to collect. But this one's going back into circulation. All right, guys, so we're going to continue to search. I just want to let you know about one thing that I've been working on. And it's called the $2 Bill Project. So the $2 Bill Project, I'm going to be using these $2 bills that I have. And what I'm going to do is put them in circulation to see people's reactions and then post it on social media, such as YouTube and TikTok. But look at this. We got ourselves a first star note. Not too bad of condition either. Uh, series 2013. Not bad. Let's put that one to the side and let's keep this hunt going. All right, with this solar bill, I saw that I was bleeding some text through it and I flip it over. It's pretty cool. It says, uh, if you like golden dollar coins and $2 bills, ask for them at your bank. If they're out, tell the manager to order them. And I kind of found this funny because that's exactly what I did. They only had six two dollar bills behind the counter and i asked if i can order a thousand dollars worth and after a little bit of waiting they said of course so all right guys it looks like we have our first 1976 which is not bad condition now with the 1976s at least for me i only have uh 100 of them that i collect I don't feel the need to collect more than that, but every single time that I do get $2 bills and I look through them, if I get a 1976 in better condition, I will swap out the bills and put in my collection, while the other one I just return to the bank or spend it out somewhere, so. First 1976, I have a feeling we'll find a whole lot more. All right, guys, we're back. We got a few 76s, the star note, as well as some other bills that I like. We'll see what they're worth or if they're anything special later. But I've kind of hit a nice 1976 run. This one's a little creased, but it will. Um, I've just pulled about three of them up, and I'm like, they, they keep on going. So let's see how many more we get. Just put them aside for now and look at their condition later. 
This one's actually not too bad, except it has a little bit of a crease. But it's pretty cool pulling a bunch of these 76s. I guess they were trapped next to their next to each other for a while. So let's see how many more we can pull. But just in this little consecutive stack, it's been about 20 of them in a row. And I believe this is the last one. All right, well, off to the hunt. We still have a good amount left to go through. All right, guys, looks like we got ourselves another star note. Now, the other, this star note's not in as good shape as the other one, but another star note means that this haul is worth a little bit more. We're about halfway through right now, a little bit left. Let's see what else we can find. So not even two notes later, we found yet another star note. Great condition, as well as a bill with a lot of ones on it. First four are ones. Maybe we'll find another one. Maybe we won't. But, actually this one's not bad. A lot of the uh, bills I've been pulling, I've got about a stack of 25 over here are in nice condition and with those I'm gonna put them online to see if people are interested in buying them for more than two dollars. Included I have also a top loader, a plastic sleeve that I put over to protect the bill. So if you want one, they're on Macari, the selling app. Macari is not a sponsor but. All right guys, so this next bill we pulled is another note. So it says $12, 2002. The bill is from 1995, and it says Love Mom. So notes like these, rather than just one that I found earlier that just said something I couldn't read, these are notes I like to keep because they serve a message. They Clearly, Mom felt it was important to sign this note. And she probably gave either two fives and a two, a ten or a two, a single, ten singles and a two. But this is just part of, like, the history of the $2 bill, you know? So many people use them. So many people use them in different ways. I just love the messages on bills, and I find it very interesting. And it's something that I add to my collection most of the times. So this one's going aside. On to the hunt again. Uh, we really haven't been pulling any, like, birthday notes or, you know, uh, notes that had uh, a lot of repeating digits, but three star notes so far, I think that's a good haul. Also, we pulled a bunch more of the uh, nice condition bills, such as this one, to see if we can sell them later on. All right. All right guys, so I just finished going through my $2 bills and this is what I found. So I did find that one 1995 note that had this special message from mom on it. I found two, four consecutive single digit numbers. So this one has 6666 and the bottom one has 1111. So I'm not sure if those are worth anything, but it's pretty cool to hang on. So I'll see and I do some research on those. I found a total of three star notes, which are pretty cool. The first one I think is in the best condition, as well as this one. This one's a little yellowed out, but nonetheless, three star notes are pretty cool. Definitely put them in the books. Next up, I found about 60 $2 bills that are in good condition. So I'm gonna see if I can put them online and sell them for more than $2. Uh, in the past, I sold $2 bills on Macari for $4 each, and I think that's a fair offer if they're in good condition. When I did uh, sell them last time, I had 50 consecutive, and I sold them as is. So it was pretty cool getting a pretty buck for something I only spent less than $3 for. And last but not least, I found 36, 1976, $2 bills, some in better condition than others. But overall, I think this was a success in that I did find some star notes, some 1976s, 
and who knows if I'm going to sell them, but some sell-worthy $2 bills that I'm going to put on my Macari account. All right, guys, so I appreciate you watching my videos. Uh, I do plan on posting more in the future. Uh, things have been busy for me during work, but now that I have been working, I can start affording more and more bigger purchases from the bank, like the last video, the $1,000 in quarters, and this video of the $1,000 in $2 bills. So I'm going to leave you at that. If you did like the video, please like. If you liked it even more, please subscribe. It will really help grow the channel. And I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Happy collecting.